Okay. I hate the cold. Oh, I really don't want to do this. Come on. Just jump, you think? Every time you see Crocs, you think of us? Yes. I'm not sure how I feel about that, Jana. I'd heard about the cold water, but I don't know if I really understood how cold the water like was. Like this sign said 68 degrees yeah. year round. So. You can do it, Steve. <laughs> Dude, he got us. He got us good. So last night we actually took the walking path right outside of the park here. There's a walking and biking path. They said it's several miles long. We obviously haven't explored much because it's our first day, but that's what we're gonna take the bikes on. Uh, we walked from here to a little restaurant down the way and it took us about 20, 25 minutes to walk. It was about a mile. So the bike should be a lot quicker. So we're gonna explore on that bike path today. So where are we at now? Seaside. This is Seaside. This is Seaside? Would you or like to get a picture? Seaside. Would you like to get a picture of Seaside? Oh, there it is. It says it right there. Every time you see Crocs, you think of us? Yes. <laughs> I'm not sure how I feel about that, Jana. You should feel good about it. So one of the cool things about this RV park is on the other side of the park, you have beach access. It's got this little boardwalk that goes right to the beach. So you can just ride your bikes or you can walk straight to the beach. Beautiful white sand. You don't have to leave the RV park to get here. Listen to the sand. And that Why is it squeak like that? I don't that? know. Welcome to Squeaky like Beach. That. Who can do the louder squeak in the sand? <laughs> you can tell who's competitive. Me and Steve are both like, <laughs> got it. <laughs> like, oh, it's definitely us. I pulled a hammy. <laughs> How cold is it, babe? It's a little chilly. So. <laughs> Now's your chance, Steve. Go. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Why did I not see that coming? <laughs> Thank you. 
All right, you ready to go adventure? I'm ready, are you ready? I'm excited. So we've been staying at Grayson Beach the past, what, three days? Grayton, but close, he did pretty good. Grayton Beach. Grayton State Park. And we're getting ready to go check out some springs today, and these springs are at? <laughs> well, we think we're going to Morrison. Morrison which is about a 50, five zero minute drive from Grayton State Park. It's a county park, it says it's free, so fingers crossed for that. And then there's another one close by called Ponce de Leon uh, State Park that's also a spring. So, you can go check out some springs. Hang out mm -hmm. with our friends, mm -hmm. enjoy the sunshine. It it's is nice. really nice today, it is a little windy, so. Yeah, but it's gorgeous. So. Right. We're already late, so let's go. You're not late if we don't really have a schedule, right? Okay, cool. It's been a minute since we've seen any springs. When we, we were living in Florida, Ocala, Florida, for about five months last year, about a year ago right now. And we got to visit several springs while we were there, but I always forget like how pretty they are. pretty frigid so a uh, really nice park four dollars to get in which I mean can't, beat, can't that. beat that so they got this set up kind of like a pool but they left the natural spring there a um, little like diving board thing that they've made out of concrete so really cool really, cool. really cool I'm impressed we lived in Florida for like five months last year and I don't think I got in a spring the entire time so I'd heard about the cold water, but I don't know if I really understood how cold the water I think was. The sign said 68 degrees yeah. year round. So Ooh. Definitely but. cold. Definitely <laughs> beautiful, crystal clear Gorgeous. Florida spring water. But I will say too, I got out of the water and everybody's like, Steph, you okay? No. I had these little red bumps all over me. And I normally don't get like weird skin things. This kid sometimes does. But little red bumps all over me. We got to looking at the signs. There's an algae that causes like something called swimmer's itch. It's got these little red bumps all yeah. over me, but they're already gone within like an hour. Yeah. So, so be aware, don't touch the algae. Be swimmer aware. Swimmer aware. Algae aware. All right. All right. On to the next adventure. I don't know where we're heading now. I don't know. Probably ramen tonight. Though, right? <laughs> <laughs> 